what is up guys and welcome to day 37 we are officially halfway through the trip I can't believe how quick it's gone. We have a new tour leader, Brad, um, who went on the bike tour in Chicago with in my previous vlog. And um, we're just backing up to go and leave Chicago and head into Wisconsin today. I love it. <laughs> am I in America or am I in Pisa? I just don't know. <laughs> Goodbye to the fake cleaning tower, Pisa. My Instagram is gonna be on. So we're having our lunch break and we've just gone to the cheese factory but we're not really fancying cheese. Um, but I had a Panda Express at the first gas station we stopped in. So um, just gonna chill for a bit. It's really bright. We have just um, queued up on these many seats and we're just on a, a boat tour. On a boat, I'm stuck with Ella and Sarah for today. Um, and we have um, this lovely umbrella in front of us but the sun is shining and um, the group is split up yeah we have begun so I've sort of had to borrow Sarah's bag. She's got it attached because I was worried it's gonna, you know, plop in the water here. This lady's hair is really long and it's itching my legs. <laughs> Ella thinks it's hilarious and looks very amused. <laughs> and Sarah's getting burned. <laughs> and this is a lovely view of some open waters. <laughs> My knees are free! <laughs> we have got off the boat. Um, not really sure where we are. <laughs> it's rather warm. The guys are all behind. And the witch's bath. The witch's bath. The witch's bath. Seriously, you couldn't have taken the plastic off now, could ya? <laughs> Here we have the witch's window. Oh. Oh, it's quite far up. Oh. Oh. <laughs> this is spooky, ladies. confectionery store bit. Everyone, Sarah's got an ice cream, Anna's got an ice cream, we're a bit blurry. And I have an ice cream. Um, it's called a twist, chocolate and vanilla, which I don't think I've had before. Having a bit of a malfunction, we've accidentally left the rope on the pole. So we've had to, we can't get it off the pole. I say we, this bloke, we have the pole. So we've come well, you ain't special dying. measures to cut the rope. Oh, hello. hello. Bit of a zoom, a bit too much zoom. There we go. Oh, oh, we're free. Are we free? Are we free? Yes, and we've lost part of the rope. I don't listen to the German Is everybody ready? Yeah. Shut up. So this is the original photograph and then we just sort of dog jump off that and we're just heading in a U now for the last second walk of the day. <sighs> <sighs> and then, just casually, we've ended up in another confessionary place. Okay, so they're all coming. Oh. This is the luncheon hall, where there is no lunch provided. <laughs> but beautiful views and random food. <laughs> this is where we have just sailed, cruised, wherever you would like to call it. 
Sarah's been roped in to take a photo, so I'm just gonna video while I'm here. And it's quite free because I think everyone's either using the restroom or buying more food because it smells so good. The popcorn <laughs> literally was just like, keep walking, do not buy the popcorn. <laughs> So this is the toe store. So this is Visitor's Lodge. Visitor's Ledge! <laughs> I can't read. Wow, that's really cool actually. Oh, this is cool. I'm just heading back onto our boat. Beautiful waters and scenery. This is the boat tour that we did, Dell's boat tours. Very good, highly recommended. This is my current look, the Holly Safari look. But I am not burnt. <laughs> my head is nice, nice and cool. Just setting up camp at the Wisconsin Dell's KOA. Anna's just pumping her mattress up. Um, this is mine and Sarah's tent, where we have a hole right here. Oh, that's been patched up. A massive stain. And where's the other hole? Oh, it's been taped up, the other hole. It's going well. This is all Sarah's stuff. <laughs> oh, dinner today. Thanks to group one. Um, pasta, mince, bread, and some salad with mushrooms. The best thing to have that I with. Bit like, you bit spoon salad. <laughs> what else are you having? It's only half eight and I'm literally <laughs> gonna hop in the shower and go to bed. I'm so tired. I had about six hours sleep last night. Um, prepared. Um, look at this lovely campground. Our toilets are in this building here, so it's not too far for me and Sarah. But everyone's sort of, it's a very busy campground. Everyone's just finishing doing washing. Um, so this is our new van. Um, I'll quickly show you. <laughs> Um, we actually have a logo um, and we have a new trailer but it's actually smaller than our old one but it somehow still fits all our stuff in so that's exciting and um, we're going to Minnesota tomorrow to the Mall of America which is the largest mall in America I believe and there's a, like a theme park in the mall which I'm so excited for so I shall catch you guys tomorrow so it shook it down with rain and we had the most, I feel like the longest ride, but it's only been four hours. This is um, where we're heading. We're off to get some Indian food. We're currently in the Mall of America, which is the largest mall in America. Oh yeah, but not in the world. trying to find the Indian we're not really succeeding so yeah this is a casual butterfly flat and you can actually like fly it um, we had a major fail we wanted Indian food and they didn't have any chicken so we couldn't get any chicken to the sala so now we're trying to find some steak so Anna and I went to a naf naf grill. I really wanted to try a falafel, so I got one. Um, some chicken and rice with some bread on top. And these guys went to chick chick filler. Is that? Yeah. 
Here is the butterfly from Look Around, floor up. It's just making it fly. This mall is insane. Here, yeah, three levels. We're just gonna go to the theme park. Just stop the robot and just dance. <laughs> what the heck? Can you stop going, please? Just waiting for people in Sephora, but look how it just keeps going. Small, <laughs> so mad. Hello, and I have just purchased tickets for this one. This Excuse me, I'm trying to talk about blog. Please place loose articles the in the cabinet for leave them with a nine. So I made Ella here jump on a ride with me, and she is terrible. <laughs> Uh, this is the ride above us. I don't quite know where it is. Oh, it's there. Oh, it's gone. Oh, never mind. Here it goes. And it like spins. So, I'm waiting for it to come round. Here we go. Woo! I, said, I just can't believe that this is in a goddamn. Whoa! I can't go quick enough! <laughs> Bye! Oh, my hair! We've just done the fairly odd coaster. Hello, what did you think? It wasn't so. <laughs> because it twists. It's a bit like Crush Coaster in Disney if you've ever been there. We're just waiting for our friends to go on so we can watch them go. Here we have the rest of our trek route going on the coaster. Make sure you have your seatbelts on. Here they go! <laughs> just can't get over how unreal this is. This is um Nickelodeon universe. Uh, there we go. Oh, the log flume just going. So this shop is called Dodo, -Do, I believe. It's just dough that's uncooked, right? Is it? No, it's not. It's uncooked. It's raw egg. This is dough. This is the confusion. Ella has got a, a dodo. We have mint chocolate chips, s'mores, coffee, some M&M, and I don't know what the fifth one is. Oh. We've reached it sort of near the end. Mall of America, loads of seating, and then we have all the flags above us. Also in the mall, we have a sea life aquarium that you can like pay to stay overnight and sleep under the sharks. Like, why are we staying in the tent? Bye. So this is our campground in Minneapolis. Um, mine and Sarah's is this one here. We've sort of left the airport because it's a little bit stuffy in our tent. Um, group two are making dinner. I'm currently going to be washing up tonight. We spent the day in Minneapolis, um, the largest mall in America, I believe. And it was called the Mall of America. We went on a ride in the mall, which is insane. I actually didn't buy anything. I just had lunch and just paid for the ride and that was it so it's been a cheap day for me um yeah we're just gonna have a chilled one um it has been raining um it rained that's why we went to the mall and now it's okay thank god so fingers crossed it won't rain in the night and it'll be nicer tomorrow although i believe it is thunderstorming what is up guys welcome to day 39 um we've got a very long day today 10 hour drive i believe it is like We've stopped, so about seven, eight hours maybe. We're just having lunch in this lovely um, pavilion. Um, got <coughs> excuse me, I got myself a baguette. Um, pork from yesterday and some chicken for lunch. I'm just bored of wraps right now. I really need to sleep on this journey because I'm just so tired. Even though I am sleeping at night, so. I've just seen a load of lightning. Look at the sky. Oh, I think there's a tornado coming and thunder. The storm looks so cool. Um, we currently stopped at 
a come and go. No word of a lie. I've literally just bought some playing cards that say come and go on them because I thought it was hilarious. Um, but I'm, I'm glad we're not going to be in this storm. Well, I hope we're not going to be in this storm. Um, but we've been on the bus for like four hours and I'm not joking. I cannot get comfortable and it's driving me nuts. Oh my God, it's such a rain. I'm going to go back and plan. This is the current weather we are experiencing. Currently in Missouri, just passing through. Ella's eating some cookie dough. Whoa! Um, it's a bit thundery and yeah, just a bit wet. Just arrived in the American Jazz Museum. Um, so our lunch break was actually in Iowa. I think that was our only stop in Iowa and now we're in Kansas where we'll be staying the night. And we've got cabins tonight. <laughs> Learning about American Jazz right now in a very empty theater with lovely graffiti on the wall. Reading up on Louis Armstrong. It's a very cool museum. This is a cool room. Rhythm. I think my music teacher would be proud right now, me learning about choosing to learn about American jazz. I think that's different. And it's actually really interesting. But yeah. I might listen to a few bits. Here we have an actual jazz bar. Oh, I keep the chair. <laughs> it's going well. It's really, really cool. Oh, I see they got the artists on the side. Oh, the graffiti on here is like artwork, shall I say. It's really, really good. The American Jazz Museum. It's quite a cool front, actually. We've all just got an emergency, let's say, and a tornado's been spotted in the area. The clouds are legit, like, so gloomy. It's starting to rain as well. Um, and that noise, oh my God, did that just flash? Oh, I'm going inside. <laughs> we just got in the store. We've had to go in the back cooler. Hey, Ella, how are you feeling about this? <laughs> the back, back cooler, not the back. The back. <laughs> oh yeah, we're in the back cooler. I'm rocking it. What? <laughs> what, not the back, back cooler? So Sage, two antics at the meat locker, I've just got Ella's hair turned around on. This is my handiwork. Everyone is still chilling. And we've just found a chill in the chiller. And look, there's a weed dog. So in the meat cooler we have a, a beef loin. We have some hot dogs. Um, we have bone loin oh my god well, so if we get hungry Ella we can just eat the food we <laughs> well we'll find a grill we just managed to come out um, it's quite serious um, I think some people's homes may have been you know damaged by the process this is the current situation there's a siren going off and it's chucking it down with rain it's not it's not good I think we're just gonna get a microwave of a wheel tonight you can check. Uh, Having dinner in the van. Just got some chicken tenders, there. mac and cheese, and some beans. Oh, We're heading off now. So, we just arrived in our campground. I believe it's a KOA Kansas City I'm gonna go with. <laughs> um, I just I feel awful. I'm trying to keep my hopes up, but these people in my group are I just don't get along with, and I generally think they're strangers to me. And I just feel so insulted still and I feel like they don't get my humor and I, I think they feel a bit insensitive but I'm one of those people I don't know how to react in like when a bad situation happens so I almost like my subconscious move is to laugh and I know that's bad and it comes across as bad but I generally that's just who I am and I don't know they, they're making me feel awful um, and I just almost want to cry because I don't want this holiday to make me feel awful or like I want to enjoy myself and I generally feel like I'm going to burst into tears at any moment and I generally miss my other two trek groups because I, I honestly love them to bits now if you're watching. Love you guys, miss you guys, come back and join me because I can't deal with this anymore. I was actually wanting to leave in Chicago because I just wasn't enjoying it but then I thought why am I meeting these people? they're ruining my holiday and I don't I'm not gonna let them ruin my holiday and then we had a new tour leader and things started to improve a little bit I just feel like I could get along with my tour leader a bit more and talk to him and he seems very enthusiastic his, Brad, his name's Brad and 
I don't know if half the team like him very much because they're used to our old tour leader and they haven't welcomed him. That's just how I feel about the situation. And guys, I'm honestly just so bored of feeling miserable and awful all the time. And I just miss like talking to my friends because of the time difference. I know it's only six hours, but it's been really, really tough because these people just don't get me at all. And it's just really, really sad. So today we've upgraded to a cabin. Um, these are the other two. Um, I'm gonna call it a night there. I'll catch you guys tomorrow. Good night guys, bye. Good morning guys. I thought I'd just like to show you that we are staying on Dorothy Lane and this is our wee cabin. This is such a nice campground. So much space. I think everyone's gone back to work after Memorial Day weekend and Memorial Day. So, I mean, there's a lot of RVs, just no one obviously camping. This was the cabin that we've been staying in. We've got a lovely, oh, I've just dropped my tissues on the floor. <laughs> a lovely bench swing. Um, and then we have micro fridge, um, double bed, top bunk, lower bunk. I was on the top tonight. Um, it's a really, really nice space. Um, we, of course, we didn't have, it's really dark, we didn't have any electric, and then someone left the light on, so at like 2.30 in the morning, the lights went bam, and we were like, yeah. So we thought it was like something, like a siren or something, but no, someone just left the light on and the electric came back on. So last night I went for a shower, and the showers were working, even though we didn't have electric and it was hot water, but I did have to use my head torch. That was an experience. <laughs> I am feeling a little bit better today, but I'm gonna take a single seat um, and just sewn out the bus run, I think. Because I feel like I need it, I need some me time. That's ready for the ride to Oklahoma. We stopped off at a gas station and I really wanted a coffee and the registers wasn't working so they gave the coffee for free but this is a cinnamon coffee with ice cream and hazelnut creamer and it's dead good um we just stopped off for lunch but i have to walk like a mile to go to the toilet annoyingly hi hi what can you do when in oklahoma you have to go to a cowboy museum <laughs> yeah, learning about cowboys today it's always good we're just in the gallery Really nice pictures. I know, yeah. Oh, the lanterns are so cute. Lighting fixtures. Oh. Oh, there's a rat. Hey, oh, that's my place. So cool. Look, it's Wichita. That comes in. Wow. 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 As if this is in a museum. Wow. Oh. I found another deer. So me, Mark and Brandon cooked dinner for today. We have some chicken, broccoli, asparagus, peas and some rice. So we've arrived at the KOA in Oklahoma. Oh, I just did cooking so I haven't really had a chance to show you around. But basically these two are exactly the same but this one's the one that I'm currently staying in. So this is all um, Brandon and Nikki's room stuff. Oh, I better shut it just in case we get all the bulbs in. Um, and then toilet shower oh a microwave fridge and then we have the tiniest of oh of stairs and then this door leads to exactly the same on the other side and this is all our stuff here this is my bed for the night i have the cutest window and i was so excited sarah and sam are sleeping here and anna's staying here what is up guys welcome to day 41 um i've just loaded the trailer and we're heading for breakfast today. We're going to Denny's. Um, I don't think I've had it before, but I'm looking forward to it. We're saying goodbye to this place. That was my room up there. <laughs> Loved it. Look at it, it's so cute. Um, really, really nice place. It's a KOA holiday. Saying goodbye to this place, it's so low. Like, 
I'm quite small. Um, this was my bed with the window. But I wanted to show you these stairs. This was such a mission to go see because of these narrow stairs. But we did it. Ella and I have got a chukanama pancakes with egg bacon and some hash brown. Ella copied me. No, I, I found it first. What? Because I don't want you to film me. So yeah, they do grad nights. So that was Denny's, uh, I thoroughly advise heading here. I think they do all day breakfast, so which is super nice. Um, we're just about to hit a Walmart. I think we've got like a two and a half hour journey though, with maybe a gas station stop in the middle. Today is our first trip to Walmart as a group. I mean, me and Ella sort of went cheekily <laughs> by ourselves, but you know, first time in Walmart. Hello. No wait, now. Uh, hello, I'm Ollie. <laughs> went to Walmart. I'm not too sure what I bought, <laughs> but here it is. So I just bought a sleeping bag liner from Walmart and this outfit from the thrift shop. Just had lunch in this beautiful park. Safari Holly is back. I bloody love this hat. It stops my head from like burning because I've got such dark hair. Um, I'm so bored of wrap, so I had a pepper with hummus and two yogurts and then I have a saxuma. Is this cool? So we've just arrived at um, Fort West Stockyards. We just saw this the cat will pass. Um, just really sightseeing now. It's so warm. Oh, it's so cool though. Ah, oh. hotel in Texas. Ella loves the Dr Pepper. We found some original Dr Pepper. So you have to drink. Do you know you have to drink it within the next 30 minutes? And if not, it will taste flat. Yeah, if you're not going to drink it. Damn. We had to do it. Had to be done. Folk just having snack and drinks, and then there's just some random cattle passing us. Oh yeah, no. We've just arrived in Dallas Arlington KOA. This is my Thursday hunt. Um, guys, just cooking a stir fry. I'm just having a chilled evening. I've decided to come out of camp because tensions are running really, really high, I feel. Um, everyone's just getting, like, it's just very intense. Um, and I feel like some people are gonna snap. So I'm gonna get out of that situation today because I don't need it. And then tomorrow, a free day in Dallas, so hopefully I'll enjoy that. Oh, a little bridge from the toilet to our campground is all lit up. It's so cute. Oh. We have a stir fry tonight. Okay, so what was the difference here? Oh, so um, that's that's the way there is a switch away. So don't. There's plenty oh, okay. in so there. Veggie version, so a normal sorry, version, and a non spicy version. Soy. Soy. 